But the good thing is that um, expectations are less stretched than last time, so that's good. Uh, for the rest, you really would like to see something that gives confidence that this will all work. The concern that has been building in the markets with, general, with central banks in general, start with the BOJ, mm -hmm. is um, are we getting closer to the limits and what can you then do? Are and we getting closer to the limits and what then can you do? Well, that is of course the thing that we have been used by Mario Draghi mm. to statements like we have plenty of opportunity to do things. And um, I think there is this hope that there will still come up something that is different from what was on your screen, which was really very comprehensive in terms of what can be done. The only problem can is be that you've got Jens Weidmann standing in the way and there was a reluctance from the Germans to step up to do much in December. So how creative is the ECB really going to get today with its monetary options? Well, the attraction, for instance, of LTRO um, is that it is going back more to normal monetary policy. So rather than doing more on the non-conventional, let's do something more on the normal. The question that you then have is that will markets say, fantastic, will euro stocks start to rally, which lasts more than two days, for instance? And that is the key question. But I think more importantly, what is um, essential is that you come with something that one, you have to create a bit of a surprise, but also it must give confidence that it will make credit flow more easily than has been the case up until now. Of note for the markets is the fact that negative interest rates haven't done a lot for market sentiment, not like the old days of Kiwi where you saw this very easy trade, get a bit more Kiwi, go and buy stocks. If the ECB is looking at its options today and looking at whether to do more on the negative deposit rate or more on the QE side, is there an argument that if you expand the remit of being able to buy certain types of debt instruments, this would be positive for stock market action? Well, if it means that you have to go less low on the deposit rate, that would be a relief. Um, secondly, uh, it would address the issue of the limitations, the fact that there's just not enough bonds out there anymore. Uh, if I put it in an exaggerated way. So that indeed would be, would be welcomed. Um, it's also why people are looking forward to uh, t whether tiering will be introduced, yes or no, because that would be another issue to address the downsides of the negative rates.